Okay, now let's briefly talk about how we can set uh, alerts, notifications in Weeble on additional stocks so we can get uh, notifications if it hits a price target uh, at a support level that we may want to consider for a buy or uh, take profit a price target above to uh, see if we want to sell. So if I go to the stock screen on Weeble and I can pull up any stock in the stock screen by searching or in my watch list and I'm going to use OBCI since that's uh, was sitting in our watch list right now and let's say I want to set an alert if it hits the 785 uh, support level. So what I can do is I can click anywhere close to that level doesn't have to be exact but if I right click and then I can say okay create alert at 785 now in this case I got exactly on that price target but you can see I can I can change that number there very easily to uh, make it fit uh, where I want it to go in this case I'm looking for it to dip below that price now maybe I want to say okay if it goes below 786 that means it's going to be you know near 785 and you can see you can set it on price percent change or volume and then you can put a note you know support at 785 and you can say buy at support whatever you want the note to be when it pops up and then you just hit save and you see this little arrow pops up and it tells you if you hover over it, it's an alert when the price is below 786. So when that occurs, you will get a, a system notification, a desktop notification. It'll pop up on your, on your screen with that message. It'll show up in your desktop notifications uh, in that area. And then, you know, you can look at it or clear it. Um, right now, as far as I know, Weeble does not support email or text alerts. So again, you have to be watching the screen um, or you come back and you see, oh, there's some notifications and that means these alerts have hit. Now, if I want to set an uh, alert, for example, for a sell, for a take profit, let's say on OBCI, I want to set it if it hits up here at this uh, peak level. Very similarly, I just put uh, my cursor somewhere near that area, and that looks like 1521. I right-click, I say create an alert, and I can say, okay, if it's above, let's say 1520, price above, sell at resistance at 1521. So again, if the price goes above 1520, then maybe I want to sell it there. I just hit save. And again, we see the, the little triangle to the right side of the screen it says, okay, when the price moves above 1520, I'm gonna get a system notification. If you wanna modify that alert, it's very easy, just click on it. Let's say I, you know, I wanna change that to whatever, 21. I just save that. Okay, now sell, sell if it's above 1521. So again, you can see how easy it is to set up these alerts, modify the alerts. If I want to delete that alert, I can just click on it, say delete. Okay, now it's gone. So it's, it's really easy to create, modify, delete alerts in Weeble. Again, these will be triggered if the price happens to hit, uh, in this case below, in the uppercase above, that alert. It shows up on your screen. You can go look at it, make a decision whether you want to buy or sell based on that alert. So again, we'll, we'll do more uh, videos, more detail on uh, alerts, using alerts in Weibo probably in the future, but uh, we hope that helps. Uh, you can also see, again, our previous video on how to set alerts in Thinkorswim. Um, again, this gives you great coverage uh, from the different platforms, different stocks you're watching in the different platforms. So we hope this all helps. Thank you again for watching our video. We hope that you liked it. If so, please smash the like button. Give us a thumbs up. If you're not already subscribed, please consider subscribing to our Beachbum Trading YouTube channel. 
Please share this video with your fellow traders and friends. And please give us your feedback and any recommendations for improvement in the comment section below. And let us know what else we can do to help you in your trading career. Thank you again. Good luck and have a great trading day.